Nashville police are investigating a burglary at a new restaurant. Police say the person responsible tried to take liquor and money from that business. Way 31 Sydney Martin is live in downtown Huntsville after talking to the business about this break in. Sydney. One of the partners here at Fat Sammy's told me it's open again after learning someone was inside and didn't only take money but drank some of their booze. Jeremy Concepcion is one of the partners at Fat Sammy's in downtown Huntsville. This surveillance video reveals what happened inside Sunday night while the business was closed. He finds some booze, finds the lights, and at some point realizes there's cameras, goes to the back where the uh, employee room is and finds a, a blue cardigan, a dark blue cardigan, and a dirty server apron, and covers his face with the apron and puts a cardigan on and comes back on the camera. So we, we thought for a while, oh, it's, it's two different people. In the video, you see the suspect empty the cash drawer into a linen bag, but Concepcion said he didn't get far with it. Either he was too drunk to carry it or he got spooked, and so he left, you know, all this stuff behind. Fat Sammy's opened only two days before the state forced restaurants to do carry out or delivery only because of coronavirus. Concepcion said the restaurants doing all it can to get by. We didn't receive any government assistance at all, so we haven't gotten a dime. Despite taking huge revenue hits in our projections, you know, there's still a monthly bill, bills that don't care about a virus. And he said although the person responsible didn't get away with much, it still hurts. It's not a, it's not a huge loss. It's not good. You know, it's a bill, basically. It, that would have paid a bill, um, a monthly bill. So, I mean, it's not great. Tonight, Huntsville police are asking anyone who recognizes the suspect in the video to contact them. In the meantime, the business hope he doesn't come back and that he's caught. Live in Huntsville, Sydney Martin, Way 31 News. Well, you can take another look at the suspect in that video by checking on this, uh, clicking on this story rather, on WayTV.com. New information.